Yo, what's up? This is Patrick from Guy in a Cube. And in this Two Minute Tuesday, I'm gonna talk all about the new look and feel of the Power BI mobile app. Let's get into this, all right. So if you, the first place, you, the first thing you need to do is download the mobile app, right? If you don't have it on your phone, get it downloaded. Once it's download, download it, download. Once it's downloaded, click, open the mobile app. And if you haven't did it connected before, you'll need to get all connected. We'll talk about that in a little bit. If you have, you'll see the little hamburger in the top left corner. Go ahead and click it. It's three lines, three lines. Click it. And then you'll see down at the bottom, it says new look. Go ahead and click new look. Right, I click new look, and what's gonna happen is it's gonna take me and it's gonna bring me through this little guided tour of what's available in the new look. I like it, a little guided tour, right? I like going on tours. So the first thing is it's gonna say, look at the new content on your page, all right? Yep, got that. So it's gonna show me some recent and frequent things. I'm excited about that, click next. New navigation experience. I'm looking forward to this new navigation experience because I hate sliding from the left. I'm hoping they're doing something different there. And then I can switch between Power BI accounts so easily because I got so many Power BI accounts. I got so many. All right, so let's go. Let's get started. All right, so now the first thing you may notice is all the custom branding. If you set up custom branding on your on your Power BI site, you'll see it on your mobile app. They're bringing, they're trying to, it looks like they're trying to bring the experience from the web browser to my mobile phone. I'm digging that, I like that a lot. If you've never set up custom branding, it's so easy. If you go over to PowerBI.com, click admin portal, and then click custom branding, then you can set up your custom branding, right? I had to call marketing, I had to call the guy in the queue marketing because when I tried to do this video, it wasn't set up. Anyway, I digress, I digress. Okay, so once you have it set up, you'll see the new look and feel. Once they make the change, if you have the mobile app open, if you just pull down on it, it'll refresh, I promise, okay? Just like that, it'll refresh and your custom branding will show. All right, so let's get into some of this new stuff. So that's the first thing, that's number one, right? Your custom branding shows up. The next thing is the home page. Look at the home page. I can see the things that I frequently visit and I can see the things that I recently visit. This is great, right there at my fingertips. There's a new tab besides the quick access tab for activity, right? You're gonna be able to see all your comments and things right here on this page. It's coming soon, stay tuned. Tuned. they're gonna announce when it comes right and then if you look at the bottom navigation right you got your home page I can click my favorite so everything that I want to access quickly I'll go ahead and favorite those they'll show up in this list my apps all the apps I have access to they're right there at the bottom if I want to access and you know toggle through my workspaces BAM right there in the bottom navigation if I click the ellipsis I can see all the things, again, that I recently accessed. They really want me to go to the stuff that I recently accessed, all the stuff that's shared with me, and then the scanner. If you've created a QR code for your report, you can go into scan mode and scan that QR code, and then bam, that report will open up really quickly. This is just great. And then in the top menu, I can search everything throughout that I have access to in Power BI. I can look at all my data alerts. So if I have data alerts set up, I have one little central place to go look at that. And the final thing I wanna show you is if you click your picture in the app, you can toggle the new look off, you can go to settings, and you can switch between Power BI accounts, connect to your Power BI report server, all just a few clicks, just a few taps on your device. What do you guys think? This is bananas, this is great. They're bringing all the same look and feel and capability to this mobile app, so now I can do all my Power BI work right there on my mobile device. I love it, I love it. This is just making me so excited. All right, so what do you guys think? You got any questions, comments? Let's continue the conversation. Where? In the comments below. This is your first time visiting the Guy in the Cube channel. Hit that subscribe button. If you like my video, give me a big thumbs up. As always, from Adam and myself, Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Hang on, did I press record over here? Yeah. All right.